Hi everyone, my name is Allison Mariella Desir. I'm a Hoka One One Global Athlete Ambassador. I'm a mom, I'm a runner, I'm a mental health coach, and this is part two of a three-part series on goal setting. The focus of the first video was on calming your anxious mind. Anxiety often gets in the way when we're preparing for something big or making plans, so that's why we started there. Today's video is about negative automatic thoughts and what we can do about them. What are negative automatic thoughts? They happen so often that sometimes we don't even realize it. They can be things like, I'll never succeed, nobody likes me, I hate my life, things will never get better, and these play on a loop over and over again thousands of times a day in our mind. And what does that mean? The more we hear something, the more we believe it. So these negative automatic thoughts, while they may seem just mundane and unimportant, they actually have a big impact on how we feel about ourselves and the choices that we make. The good news is there's a practice that you can use to help when you have these automatic negative thoughts. The first thing to do is to try to identify what the trigger of that automatic thought is. So for example, you make a mistake at work. The automatic negative thought that happens is, I'm a failure, I might get fired. And those thoughts alone can have the power to put you in a bad mood and ruin your day, if not worse. So in that moment, pause and try to think of a new positive thought. For example, I made a mistake, mistakes happen, it's gonna be okay. That simple new reframing can have the power to improve your mood and make it easier to grapple with the mistake that was made. Our minds are extremely powerful and what we say to ourselves, what we think about ourselves matters. It affects how we feel, it affects how we behave, and it affects what we end up doing in life. So get into a habit of trying to identify triggers, identifying your automatic thoughts, and then proving to yourself that those automatic thoughts are not always true and that there are other possibilities. Thank you for watching. The last part of this three-part video will be about how to now set goals. Stay tuned.